要扩大城市，都要占耕地面积的，人口增长和耕地减少，面对这么一个严峻的形势，这个粮食啊非常严峻，就通过科技进步，提高粮食作物的单位面积产量，杂交稻是个最有效的一个途径。China is currently one of the world's largest food-producing countries. However, 50 to 60 years ago, the nation was suffering from severe food crisis. Witnessing the devastating three-year countrywide famine in the early 60s, the young Yuan Longping was stricken, making him determined to develop high-yielding crops for farmers to solve the nation's food crisis. We started to study the food crisis, 大家都没饱饭吃，人人呢面黄肌瘦，佛手，卧室人倒在田坎上，倒在桥底下，倒在路条边，说明这个粮食的这个重要性，没有没有粮食吃呢，什么事情都干不到。Hybrid crops generally have greater yields. However, before Professor Yuan pioneered the hybrid rice research, it was widely accepted that the hybrid approach could not succeed for a self-pollinating crop like rice. Professor Yuan nonetheless insisted on his research and tried hard to explore a male sterile rice variety, the key to growing hybrid rice. Finally,我们找到了啊，拉子特别高兴啊，结果就发表一篇文章，在科学通报啊也登了啊，就就影响很大。这是研究杂交稻的开端起点。哎，那个时候是呃杂草重生，而且他们的这个住的的也是草棚
by use of the hybrid rice technology. What I'm, what I'm learning here, I want to go and apply, just apply, give the knowledge to other farmers so that they will step, step, step up with their production of rice in my country so that the food situation there will improve. Aged 86, Professor Yuan insists to work in the rice field every day to check out the status of the hybrid rice under his new research, with an aim to develop an even more high-yielding and better quality hybrid rice with all-round resistance, for the enhancement of the stability and security of world food supply. Uh, 也不怕下一步会不会失败就是七千五多万公斤對我是一個鼓勵,是個鞭策,勉勵我,鼓勵我向更高的高度攀登。